私のチャンネルにようこそ。お元気ですか ?Welcome back to my channel. How are you doing? In my last video about learning cardinal numbers, we learned the formula in counting numbers 11 to 99. We just have to memorize numbers 1 to 10 so we can continue to count 11 to 99. And the formula used in counting 11 to 19 Is 10 plus 1 equals 11, 10 plus 2 equals 12, 10 plus 3 equals 13, and so on. So, for、uh, let us go back to counting 1 to 10 in Japanese, okay? 1 is 1, 2, 3, 3, 4, 4, 5, 5, 6, 6, 7, 8, 8, 9, 9, 10, 9, 10. So for 11 to 19, the formula is 10 plus 1 equals 11. So 10 is 10 plus 1. What is 1? 1 is 1. So 11 is 10 1. How about 12? So 10 plus 2. 10 is 10 plus what is 2? 2. So 10 2. How about 19? 10 plus 9. 10 is 10 plus 2. 9 is, 9 is Q. So 19 is Q, Q. The formula for 20 to 29 is 2 times 10. Okay, so 2 times 10 is 20, right? So 2, what is 2? Ni. Times 10, what is 10? Ju. So 20 is Ni, Ju. How about 21? 21, the formula is 2 times 10 plus 1. So 2 is ni times 10, which is ju plus 1, which is ichi. So 21 is ni ju ichi. Again, ni ju ichi. How about 29? 29, 2 times 10 plus 9. So 2 is ni times 10, which is ju. Plus 9, which is Q. So 29 is 2 times 2 is ni. So ni ju q. Ni ju q for number 29. And continue counting from 30 to 99. So the same pattern, the same formula. 3 times 10 equals 30. So what is 3? 3 is sang times 10. Which is ju equals 30. So 3, 3 times 10 is sang ju. So 30 is sang ju. Sang ju. How about 31? 31 is 3 times 10 plus 1. So 3 is sang times 10 ju plus 1 ichi. So 31 is sang ju ichi. Sang ju ichi. So 39, 3 times 10 plus 9. 3 is sang and 10 is ju. So 3 times 10 plus 9. Sang ju q. Sang ju q. Sang ju q for 39. For 99, 9 times 10 plus 9. What is 9? Q. Times 10, ju. Plus 9, q. So 99 is. Q, ju, q. Q, ju, q. How about 100? 100 is hyaku. Hyaku. 100 is hyaku. In today's video, we are going to learn counting ordinal numbers in Japanese. Ordinal numbers express order or sequence like first, second, third, fourth, and so on.
but in Japanese, numbers can come before or after the item being counted. So, for example, first, the counter can come before the number, like the counter for first is dai, because one is ichi, so you have to add before the number dai ichi, dai ichi. How about two or second? Dai ni. Third, dai san. Fourth, dai yong. Fifth, dai go. Sixth, dai loku. Seventh, dai nana. Eighth, dai hachi. Ninth, dai kyu. Tenth, dai chu. Another counter is bang. So this time we're going to use bang after the item being counted because as I mentioned earlier, a number can come before or after the item being counted. So this time we're going to use bang after the item, okay? So first is ichi, right? Num one is ichi. So ichi bang. How about two? Se or second. Second is ni, right? So ni bang. Three is sang. So sam bang. So you will notice that in the way I pronounce it, it sounds like letter M, right? So sam bang. It's because N is followed by a consonant letter B, and the rule and the rule is the sound becomes letter M if N is preceding letter B or P. Okay, so instead of san bang, sam bang. The same with number four is yong, right? So you add bang for fourth. So yom bang. So instead of yong, yong, change the sound into m. Yom bang. It's because n is followed by letter b, consonant letter b. So the sound may change to m. So yom bang. Okay, number five is go. Go bang. Six, loku bang. Nana bang. Hachi bang, Q bang, Chu bang. For numbers 11th to 99, follow the formula in counting the cardinal numbers. So 10 plus 1, 10 plus 2, 10 plus 9, 2 times 10, 2 times 10 plus 1, 3 times 10, 3 times 10 plus 1, 4 times 10, 4 times 10 times 1. So follow the formula. But since we are talking about ordinal numbers, and as I explained earlier, add the word dai before the number or bang after, okay? So for 11th, for example, 11th. So what is 10 plus 1 again? 10 is ju plus 1, which is ichi, equals 11. So 11th is Dai Chu Ichi. Dai Chu Ichi. Or if you may wish to use bang, so Chu Ichi Bang. Chu Ichi Bang. Chu Ichi Bang for number 11. How about number 19? So number 19 is 10 plus 9. What is 10? 10 is Chu and 9 is Q. So 19th is Dai Chu Q. Dai Chu Q. Okay, for number 21, or the same pattern, 2 times 10. 2 times 10, the same pattern as uh, cardinal numbers, okay? So 2 times 10, what is 2? Ni times 10, chu. So ni, chu. So just add dai, or dai ni ju for 20th. 20th, okay? Dai ni ju, or use bang, ni ju bang, ni ju bang. Niju bang. Okay, for 99th, 99th, 9 times 10 plus 9. Okay, 9 times 10 plus 9. So 9 is Q times 10, which is Q plus 9, which is Q. So add dai because it's we are uh, discussing about ordinal number. So dai Q Q Q. 99th is dai Q Q Q. Dai Q Q Q. Dai Q Q Q. How about 100th? So 100th is Dai Hyaku. Dai Hyaku. So 100th is 
So that's how to count ordinal numbers in Japanese. Counting numbers in Japanese is one of the most confusing points of learning Japanese because Japanese has many forms of counters in counting everything from object to animals to people to machinery. And that would be our topic next time. What we are learning today are just examples of counting ordinal numbers in Japanese using dai and bang. And we will learn more in my next video. So that's all for now. Domo arigato gozaimasu. Please subscribe and follow me, Lordes Hairston. Sayonara! <laughs>